Hi friends, so here I am back with another new video. So I went up a little out of my comfort zone and tried this pink look with the new uh, product, uh, I mean uh, new palette that I got, the Eat Sleep Pick Up Repeat Palette from uh, Princess Box. If you haven't seen my Princess Box unboxing, I'll be linking it some up, uh, up here. And uh, so this is a swatch of the various colors in this palette. It has three distinctive part and uh, I use the first part, okay, uh, the near, uh, names of each part and I'll tell you in everything in details. First, a uh, quick overview. Uh, okay, as you can see, the pigmentation is good. They were easy to blend, but I found them a bit uh, powdery, maybe uh, because I'm more used to using cream eyeshadows now, I found them to be a bit dry. You need to kind of moisture and uh, prep your eyes very well before you start uh, using this palette. That is my personal feeling. Okay, so this is how the palette looks. As you can see, it has a very decent mirror. And uh, the C section, three sections are rave on rave off repeat again so this is rave on the one that i am sporting right now and i'm really, frankly really scared going out with such loud makeup because i've never done such loud makeup i don't know i have to go to the market but i think i'll be taking it off after i shoot this video so this is rave on this is rave off and this is repeat so uh, each of the sections have different colored names. Uh, I'll start with uh, Rave On. So this I think is a good transient sachet which I've used uh, in my as a transient color. The name of it is Say It Now. I'll first say the name of each section and then show you the swatches of it. Okay, uh, this light pink which I've used in my lid is right now. And uh, this deep purple which I, have, I don't know whether you can see it not I've used it in my uh, like totally in the crease is right here and uh, this what color fuchsia deep fuchsia color is a final track and this white one is a uh, rave on first is that uh, orangish color as I said it is the most creamiest of it all and it can give you like this is like two times I've tried next is that bright pink color which is all over my lid okay this one is a bit difficult it comes up nice on the hand it has like patted well though I had to really pat it pack it in my eyes but the swatch of it is not coming that much well in the fingers as you can see third is that deep purple one again it's not that dark when I'm applying in the finger it's darker on the pan so you have to really use it two three times to get a color I'll say this uh, pickup revolution palette uh, color payoff is not that good to the palette I already have which is the uh, darkness one darkness palette uh, again I'll link the video up here of its swatches so this barely comes out as you can see it comes in the finger but it barely coming on my skin and last is the fuchsia maroon color here it is so these are the four swatches I know I've done a very bad watching of it but uh, they picked up well in the brushes as you can see uh, the color is staying I don't know how long it stayed because I am not going out with this eyeshadow list I will think not remove it maybe tone down tone it down a bit and then go out anyway so these are the first section let me show you the white which is the last one which I tried on my eyebrow as a highlighter and eyebrows and in a corner this actually has comes out good because this this one and the transition shade are much creamier than the rest of the three which are very powdery and this is how it 
looks now for the next one which is rave off so let's start with the second one uh, this section is a uh, rave off the white name is obviously the rave off this is need on the neon uh, green is hot track the deep moss almost black green is remix and this green is eat everything i have not used them i have not swatched them so let's now try the swatches first this green which is ooh this is so good it also looks very pigmented so here it is this one again feels creamier like the previous transition transient shade and it you can see it has a sh slight shimmer to it can you see the shimmer can you see it so let's try the neon green one very powdery it feels very powdery yeah barely it barely comes out. let's try the sponge applicator and see if it comes out in there okay it's picking up in it so let's try it with this yep, yep. it's picking the color with the sponge applicator here yeah. now for that dark green again this one is a bit green it looks almost blue yeah this also swatches well uh I, it reminds me one of the colors in uh, the darkness palette i think that the uh, darkness palette has a sh shade quite like to it like this so this is how again it has a slight shimmer as you can see and the last green which again is powdery and mm, matte and not much coming up on the finger as you can see again this is how it looks i think i'll have to use a brush again to see if it picks up the color yep it is picking up the color it's a beautiful green in bengali we call it kochi kola pata like the color of the very young banana leaf as you can see on the brush it's picking up the color not on with your fingers so that's the green section rave off and love for the last section before first let me read you the names uh, first is of course the white's name is repeat again and this a uh, blue one this electric blue one is a sleep all day this blue which looks a bit of a shimmer is a rave all night this one which is more purple is magician and the last one is ibiza heaven this looks very much like this color at least uh, on like on the first look it looks they look quite similar so now let's swatch them okay wow this blue is fantastic it reminds of the blue in kylie's lipstick isn't it no like the quality is not same but the color is very much like that yeah and it's really good see on one swipe you getting so much color so let's try that uh, shimmery blue one again you can see that is much of shimmer to it in fact the blues are better as you can see it coming up easily it's coming up easily okay the purple one is again very powdery as you can see it just hasn't picked up much don't think yep it's not coming on finger let's again try the brush yep it has picked up quite well in the brush and as you can see you can see it here now here nice and now for the last one again i think i'll use the brush it has picked up not that much yeah this is i think it it will pick up with the finger also yeah it has picked up with the finger here is the swatch of it uh of the three 
I think this one has the best color payoff. This one, because most of the colors were could be swatched with fingers, like can be could be finger swatched. Oh, I didn't try the whites. No, I didn't try the white in the green section as well as the white in this section. So let me first clean my fingers and try rave off. So this is how rave off looks. With it is white with a bit of shimmer, while while the white the previous one was matte. So this is how it looks. Mm. I think if you wet your brush and use it, it will be better. So this is how it looks. Now let's try the silver one. It has lot of shimmer to it. As you can see, it's like metallic silver color. And has a good color payoff. Here, focus. Yep. So that was the swatch of Eat Sleep Makeup Repeat that I got in not in this month's uh, Princess Box, but the previous month's one, and it was the uh, the biggest one, like the deluxe. Yeah, I think the three thousand three K one. And uh, the next month's uh, Princess Box is going to be a bomb. So you better start saving for it. Because yeah, Princess Box, as I said, is costly, but the products you get in it are totally worth it. And I'll say bye till next time. Ta ta.